A popular misconception we hear at the Plain Truth is if you don't do everything we prescribe for a one-planer or a two-planer, if you don't do it exactly like we lay out in the book, that means you're not a one-planer or a two-planer. We don't view it as you have to do everything we say to a T from setup, backswing, downswing, impact, follow through. You don't have to do every element to qualify as a one planer or a two planer. If you have a person who has a one plane backswing but a two plane release, we don't view him as neither. We view him as he's a one planer. He has elements of a two plane, but primarily he's a one plane golfer. He has a downswing that he needs work on. See, we view all golf swings or methodologies as either one plane or two plane. Now within one plane, there's thousands of variations and within two plane, there's thousands of variations. Just because you're one planer doesn't mean you're any good. You see guys at your local driving range that sit there and play golf. That way, he's a one planer, not very good. A lot of people think if you're a one planer, that means you're on the PGA Tour. Or you get a two planer, somebody who stands up we call this more of a peekaboo swing where you can, they'll look right through their arms during the swing. He's not any good either. The first guy's a one planer, he needs some lessons. Second guy's a two planer, he needs some lessons as well. So it doesn't mean you're any good if you're a one planer or a two planer. What we're trying to do is we want to, to get you close to being on plane and have the direction of your swing close. That's all you gotta do to hit solid golf shots and play good golf. Now as you progress in handicap, you're going to try to refine your golf swing and make it more pure one plane or more pure two plane. And that's how you're going to elevate your handicap by simplifying your golf swing so it's more repetitive. But keep in mind, there's a lot of great golfers who aren't pure one plane or aren't pure two plane. So you don't have to be perfect one plane or two plane to play great golf. You just got to be close.